Oh, oh, boy, TV. They scared, but I'm not. They don't like commentario. Y suscribe. Charles Barkley calls Kendrick Perkins a roach. All because Kendrick Perkins called him out and said he don't watch games. Him or Shaq don't watch games. So Barkley and Shaq came out here. I ain't gonna lie to you. And I'm and don't even show up to my door with that with that swing. We saw what he tried to do with Brad Miller. That didn't happen. We've seen only time I seen Shaq land something was <laughs> big shout out to Alvin Robertson. He slapped fire. Heaven and earth out of out of out of Alvin Robertson. Heaven and earth. I'll never forget that one. That's rookie Shaq, I think. Oh, on on the Nets? No, uh, Alvin Robertson's on the Spurs. Now nah, Alvin Robertson was on Detroit at the time, and I guess Land Beer and all of them was beating him up, and he just had enough, and uh, and slapped fire at uh, Al Alvin Robertson. You can find that quickly. Pull that up. <laughs> that was good. We don't believe Shaq could punch anybody. I don't. Dude, it's, but I they, don't. that's a big dude. So yeah, like who did he fight in his life? I mean, he had fights at some point. He was a big doofy. So at some point, he had to let people know, like, yo, it's up. He grew up in San Antonio too, so Texas. He had to fight at some point. But I think the Kendrick Perkins. Don't ever let somebody tell you that Shaq grew up in Newark because he didn't. Yeah, he always says that. Yeah, there you go. But I think um, he's. Let me fast forward before that. They be trying to get me on here, man. 3D. I think he. There you go. There, there you go. go. Oh, yeah. Oh, right, right. And he mushes his face crazy. Nah, it's not. This is not a mush. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> that ain't a mush. <laughs> Yo, Alvin Rob, he. Alvin, they ain't the guy that's the defensive player of the year, Alvin Robertson, is it? Yes, sir. From the, but so he got a defensive player of the year on, on the Spurs. Yes. Yes. So even that punch was kind of like, what are you doing, Shaq? You should have choke slammed him. He kind of looks like um what's homie with the sneaker with the sneaker fit with the sneaker fad that's on uh, uh on the clippers and he can't get off the bench and he's oh, like PJ. Yeah, PJ Tucker. Alvin Robinson kind of looks like him. <laughs> Alvin Robinson looks like PJ Tucker and Mr. Commodore. <laughs> My fault. <laughs> My fault. Shout out the coach. Shout out to his brother, the coach. coach. Shout out the coach. Um, I, I I find it funny. Kendrick Perkins. I think he did reply. I saw him reply, and uh, maybe this is some, some southern thing where he what said, Perk uh, said, "Carry on." What Perk said? Nah, he didn't say carry on. Nah, he he didn't say carry on. <laughs> he said Perk, uh, line, Perk got some one liners too. Perk might be rivaling Fish. I don't know if Fish is in the building. Big shout out Fish. I don't I don't know what this means. Maybe got to translate. Maybe it's too southern for me. But he said. Hey, NBA TNT, tell Chuck he ain't ready to get his feet hot with me. Yeah, he ain't ready to get his feet hot with me. You know how you dance when you boxing? Your feet start getting hot. You know what I'm saying? You okay. light in your feet. You've never had a fight in your life, so I understand. Uh, yeah, exactly. I wouldn't know. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to... <laughs> <laughs> neither one of them better not get in no ring. I nah, mean, they... Neither they... one. <laughs> throwing, throwing jabs like that. Those was nasty. And when it gets too serious... Him calling Kendrick Perkins a roach is hilarious. He said, I ain't arguing nobody with five points, man. Five points a game? <laughs> Barkley's just, he don't want it with Barkley. Because it's, see, we saw the difference between Draymond Green, who they're trying to make the new Barkley, and the real Barkley. When they were up there, he said, yo, uh, that looks like a thousand dollar suit. Yeah, it looks like it. And Barkley said, <laughs> he said, you know what? I got, you know, speaking of that, guess who asked me the other day? <laughs> Who? Nobody. <laughs> <laughs> he just... That was great. Like, that was great. We love hey, Charles for that. For Char that, we Charles. love Charles for that. He don't want... He's too witty. He's too... And he he's almost, he makes fun of himself. Like, even remember, when, when it, I always it sound like a broken record, when, they, when that show first started, Shaq almost ruined the show because he was way too serious and, and took himself too seriously. Yeah. And and Charles is just like, bro, I don't care. Like, bro, you can't. You're gonna ruin the show. Yeah. And we know about this because you know doing the YouTube thing and 
we we would try and we have uh homeboys friends uh peers we meet people online there's a certain chemistry that you like we always talk about four sportsmen us you you can't even pay but you can't buy this so Shaq jumping on that show was like Shaq yeah you funny you funny on your own and everything but that show number one is Barkley and then number two is that chemistry between Ernie Kenny and and Chuck and Chuck yeah and if you disturb it nah so now you see Shaq jumping in being big big, big doofy Shaq and jumping on Kendrick Perkins being Shaq doing his own thing his own way that's beautiful to see too and of course Kendrick Perkins is down to to rumble you know the yeah. Or as well, and he right. gets in on a joke, so I love that getting his feet right, hot. Right. Hilarious. Kendrick Perkins used to be a a a, a regular on Shaq and a Fool, a regular on Shaq and a Fool. Um, that's that's a good that's a that's a good piece. I mean, I know we 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 spent a lot of time talking hoops. We spent a lot of time talking Knicks. You said something, um, and it would be cool, you know, just to kind of let the people know. I don't know how many people we got in the building right now, but uh. That 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 would be kind of cool to let folks know. Hey, me and Fabian didn't grow up together. We didn't. We didn't. We haven't been best friends for thirty years, right? This is not a a a, a friendship of of longevity. This is a new, continuing, budding friendship. But I'm telling you guys, you would never know that unless I said something because. We just have this impeccable chemistry, um, as we do with our, with, with all ball and, and Dom. But we have this impeccable chemistry that um, you can't buy anywhere. You cannot buy it anywhere. So you know, I thought, you know, I'm glad you said that, bro, because you know, letting the people know that that this is strictly organic. Nothing about this is is uh, you know, we put this together for ten years. Nah, man, nah. This felt right, and we and we and we doing this because uh, you know, we get along well. Our relationship is great, and we love the Knicks, and we love basketball. So, I've I've been a I don't know, and I have been avoiding. I've been so uh, so stuck on the production side that I have not looked to poke the bear and go and get Flea crazy and fog up his glasses. No diddy. I got to get back on my game because I haven't heard Flea yell curse me out in a while. And now that I'm a masochist, no diddy. But I need to he I need to get this guy going because we need the show is crazy when flea is off the wall and when that when that flea thing just when we rip it down like Wolverine, it's gonna be crazy. <laughs> Damn, no yo, diddy. All that sounds flagrant. Yo, listen, listen, listen. That's why I said we love this, because guess what? Organically, he's going to piss me off at some point, and uh <laughs> sparks will fly. What we got right? What, no what, what else we got? <laughs> no, <what? laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, boy, TV. They scared, but I'm not. They don't like commentario. Y suscribe.